This is Spencer, your Tampa Bay Wallpaper and Store, and welcome to my wallpaper and painting and woodworking television show for YouTube. I want to show you how we go about painting these, these doors. It's nothing new under the sun, but the reason I show it to you is because in a lot of uh, locations, particularly commercial, if you bang into the trim around elevators or you know, where the water fountain is, you'll see that the paint comes off with, it with a little uh, friction caused by a wheel for, from a hand truck or something to that of that nature. And one of the reasons is, aside from not using the right paint, is that the surface is not properly deglossed. Now there are two ways to do it. One is chemically, and the other is the old fashioned way, and that is to simply scratch the substrate. And so that's what we're going to do. Uh, one of our painters here is going to scratch the substrate with a palm sander and show you how you go about putting a new paint over, especially a semi-gloss. We're not talking about flat paint here. Let me reiterate, this is not flat paint. This is shiny paint, this is semi-gloss. And so in order to put a new paint over to make it stick, obviously it can't be slippery the way it is, it has to be scuffed up. And so John is gonna show you with this palm sander. Go ahead, John. Of course, you wanna be wearing a mask. Now in that process, you can see that the paint is being scratched and you have like a dull, um, chalky finish after he gets done sanding it. And so what we do after that is when we're done, we take a damp cloth, damp cloth, not soaking wet, and we just wipe it down, getting the dust off of it, preparing it for painting. If you don't do that, and I guarantee you, if you don't treat the semi-gloss paint in such a way, by scuffing it up like this or by using a deglosser, you will apply a new paint and you will have wasted your time because it won't stick properly. And that will, that will be evidenced by the fact that when people pass by knocking into it with their hands or even their fingernails hard enough, you'll see that the paint will come off. Okay, so that's your tip for the day when painting over semi-gloss. And this goes for whether you're painting semi-gloss walls woodwork especially woodwork where it takes most of the abuse coming in and out of doorways and whatnot this is spencer you can reach me at www.spencercolgan.com or you can watch me on my youtube channel which is probably what you're watching me on now instagram you can reach me at 813-666-7002 and if you need wallpaper please contact wallpaperboulevard.com that is www.wallpaperboulevard.com Please make a comment on the video, click on like, and hit the little bell, subscribe to my channel, and you'll get all the new videos. Thanks for watching.